Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome to another video. In today's video, um, for me it's very exciting to be able to play Call of Duty, any of them, again, because my favorite part about Call of Duty's, the Black Ops ones, are the zombies. And for the, the Modern Warfare, normally it's quick scoping. But, but Call of Duty Ghost kind of ruined that for me. Um, one of the worst Call of Duty's, kind of an embarrassment to all the other ones in my opinion. And I think World at War... Um, or World War Three, whichever one it was, was also an embarrassment that I've heard. When I watched it, it was kind of sucky. But all the other ones have been great that I've seen. I've played all of the Black Ops, played Black Ops 1, 2, 3, and now I'm playing 4, uh, 5 years later. Um, the last time I've played any games or anything like that, it's been like about 5 years. So the last time I played it was, was when Black Ops 3 was out, and I played that. And, I, you know, if you are a Black Ops 3 person, you probably know about the Peacemaker. It was a Black Ops 3 gun. Um... Oh, I think that's when they put riot sh uh, shields into the game for zombies, and the MCMS, MSMC, or whatever it's called, the the submachine gun that was on the game. There's just so many good guns in that game, and th the zombies is always awesome for every Black Ops game. Um, zombies is one of my favorite parts, so I'm going to go ahead and give you guys a review of the Blood of the Dead. No, actually, there's three different maps that I have unlocked. Um, when I get my own PlayStation, I will buy this game and buy all these other things. Um, it also costs about $25 to get the Black Ops Pass. And then $6 for this one, which is another Zombies map. I, w I aim to have all the Zombies maps, you know, because call what's, what's, call what's Call of Duty without having access to all of the material on there? Um, so I'm, I guess I'll start out with the IX um, Zombies map. And I will do it solo I don't okay yeah I can do it solo but I'll add bots in so now you can do that also you can play you can go to custom games and you can add bots in the game and they'll basically just follow you around the whole time but it's just better it's better than having no one there but actually I don't want bots because I want to train no and they're gonna mess that up so maybe one bot I don't know I just like training that's my thing about Call of Duty training okay so since I've been playing I realized that Zombies has changed a lot, okay? So the first thing you need to realize has changed is they have elixirs now. I think they did in Black Ops 3, but I didn't play as much in Black Ops 3. I didn't, I didn't have it very long. I got My PlayStation got stolen. But anyway, um, but I don't think they have these perk machines like they do now. So basically, you get to choose which perks you use. And then if you use the Odin one, the one on the very right, it has a modifier attached to it. So every... Um, perk has a modifier now. There's 18 different perks instead of just five. So instead of five perks, which half of them aren't even on here, Juggernaut is not in the game, and Slot of Hand is not in the game, Deadshot Daiquiri is now Deadshot Dealer, um, the Quick Revive is the only thing I think that I think is still called the same thing and is still in the game, yeah. Mule Kick, Mule Kick is still is in the game from Black Ops 2 or 3. Meal kick was good, where you can have different weapons. Actually, that's a good one. I, sh I should use that one. Switch weapons faster. The additional weapon will be saved and restored to the next meal kick perk purchase. Oh, that's cool. So the, the additional weapon will be saved and restored on the next meal kick per perk purchase. So now you get down and you lose your perks. Well, it, this modifier makes it so that you switch weapons faster because you have three of them. So if you want to switch, if you want to switch to the third one, it'll be being able to switch to them faster would be a benefit because then you'd be able to once again switch to it faster um, and then it's also if you die and you lose your perks if you and you had a third gun you would lose that third gun first of all but when you buy the perk again you get the third gun back um, yeah, cause the additional weapon will be saved and restored on the next meal kick purchase the weapon reload speed is also increased which is awesome so that's just pure benefits
and the other uh, perks that are the same is quick revive so the modifier for that one you gain a sprint speed boost after health regeneration starts so normally when you get hit you don't have to heal yourself normally it just regenerates health after you don't take some for so long so, and then also reviving reviving grants both players full health and sprint speed boost and then they also make it so the weapons reload speed is increased so it seems that um, if you have If you have Mule Kick and Quick Revive modifiers, which you wouldn't, I guess, then they would both increase the re reload speed. But at the end of the day, you would just need um, the Mule Kick on for that. Another one that I like is Blood Wolf Bite. It says, quickly inflicting a lot of damage spawns a wolf companion that fights alongside the player. And it's a huge wolf, and it looks cool. And its name is like Luna or something. So it's basically one hit kills whatever zombies it decides to attack and it helps you out in a pinch. Especially when they're the, you're trying to train or something and the zombies spread out, it'll probably get the stray ones or just whatever's closest to you. Um, stamina up, I'm sorry, is still in the game. Yeah, if everyone's looking at that like, are you guys serious? Are you... An electric burst was from Modern Warfare 3, it's still in the game. Um, I don't know about any of these other ones. Deadshot Daiquiri, it used to, yeah, it does the same thing it did before, it's called, it was called Deadshot Daiquiri in Black Ops 2, I think, when it first came out, and it was on that map with all the fire, uh, and the bus, and you had to, like, get to this one location that was also its own map, uh, I don't remember what it was called, though, but aim down the site, snap to the enemy's head, which is really helpful for headshots, which are quicker kills, and then it removes scope sway, which is awesome, um, and then these are all just extra. Shield blocks damage from all directions when held. When a shield breaks, it'll trigger a defensive explosion. Standing in your ground creates a defensive circle, which boosts damage and armor over time while inside. Oh yeah, let me read the other ones. So it's for uh, Deadshot Daiquiri, or whatever, Deadshot Dealer. Gain a damage boost when on, when a, on a headshot streak. Only applies to primary and secondary weapons. Reload speed inc inc uh, is increased also. Um, wait, weapon reload speed is increased for all these. What the heck? It says it at the end of all of them. So basically the whole time you're open. Yeah. Oh, this one is not. Modifier with a random perk received. Receive a random perk not assigned to another player. Is that even a perk? Mod Basic zombies have a chance to explode when killed, leaving behind a contamination field that slows enemies and increases damage dealt to them. Cooldown increases with each explosion, but resets at the start of every round. Decre increases with each explosion. Increases? Why would that be? But reset to the very end. Okay, it's interesting. And then players with the modifier ignored by zombies while standing in the contaminated field weapon level reload is increased. So I always like to use. Actually, I'm gonna go back and use what is PhD slider. P slide to the build up charge. PhD. I feel like that was in Black Ops 3. Maybe it wasn't. But yeah, I'm gonna use Mule Kick definitely as that one. And then uh, Raw is really easy to get to. It's the first one you would get to. And I'm going to put energy, electric burst because I like when you reload. It causes an electric burst that damages and stuns enemies. So, And then the more you empty them as a magazine, the stronger the damage. So basically, the longer you have the perk, the more damage you'll do because you're always going to be shooting and reloading. Um, there's some weapons that you reload after every shot. So I haven't seen this one. Getting hit by a melee attack will not at full health. Wait, while not at full health, will cause a frost explosion that will freeze or slow enemies nearby. You can store the. Uh, three charges and in, in realistic difficulty the frost explosion will trigger will trigger regardless of health okay um so dying wish everyone keeps saying is like a must have seeing enemies near through walls receive in scan indicators and enemies approach no i don't care about that uh so yeah there's some of them are like uh eh, they shouldn't even edit it but Dying Wish. So instead of entering last stand, the, the player goes berserk for nine seconds. While berserk, they are invulnerable to melee damage. So basically, you can't, they can't can't get a hit, and is greatly, oh, and melee damage is greatly increased. Afterwards, a player is left with one health. Cooldown increases with every use. Uh, so the more you use it, the less you can basically. Long you have to wait before you can use it again, I guess. And then stamina up. 
um, that it makes you sprint speed uh, and the duration of the sprint. Yeah, so you run faster and longer, and the stamina generates faster. So basically, you can just long run forever. Time slip, equipment cooldown rate increased, mystery box, and pack a punch weapons appear faster, and it greatly reduces trap and fast travel locations. Let me show you what it looks like when you're using it with the modifier. Uh, special weapon charge rate and cooldown, uh, I'm sorry, and elixir cooldown rate are in slightly increased. Um, and then weapon reload speed is increased as well. So I guess I can just go over everything that's important about zombies, especially when you're playing on Black Ops 4. So if you're confused or if you just wanted to know if you need to get it or whatever, you guys can have a better um, opportunity to do well and enjoy the game the way it's meant to be enjoyed. So here's the Chakrams of Vengeance. Pair Chakrams, one for throwing and another for melee. And then the, what, the ability is called Flawless Vision. Score enemy kills or locate power-ups to recharge your special weapon. Gain temporary protective armor when activating it. But what you do is throw a chakram automatically ricochets. So when you throw throw the chakram, it automatically ricochets at additional targets. So it's like it has an aimbot kind of thing. It just goes hits other ones. Um, so that's really cool. And it has different stages. So I click on chakram. That is the first one called flawless vision. The second one, you gain a movement speed boost while using the chakram instead of it doing the first thing. And then the third, uh, when you level up all the way up, you level them up by using them. When you use your special weapon during gameplay, their powers grow. Activate a deadly chakram whirlwind around you. So you'll this whirlwind will be in front of you. Um, instead of the other, the ladder, you know, the other two that it showed. So the hammer of Valhalla. So it's like a Viking type thing. And you can like move it around apparently. I didn't, yeah. So a hammer for waiting direction into battle, swinging. So score enemy kills or locate power-ups to recharge your weapon. So it, it has a cooldown to recharge it, you know, that's how you do it. So the wield a mighty hammer that sends foes flying, regain armor with each foe killed. That is the first stage. And the name of it is Thunderstrike. The name of this one is Storm Barrier, and it looks different. It looks cooler. It's called the storm barrier. When you use your special weapon, their powers grow. So you place an electrical storm that stuns enemies in the area. So you put, place that storm there, and it just whoosh, wipes things out. That's a cool looking hammer. It has this like, look, 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 cool looking bird thing on it, right in front of the symbols. And that was like a tiger. And then the third ability is like some Illuminati pyramid things with like some god on in front of it. So the last one's called lightning bolt. Um, devastating enemies with a wide bolt of lightning. So a bolt of, li bolt of lightning will come out of either the hammer or the sky and crash down on these enemies. So they do some crazy things, these special um, things. So the Scepter of Ra is the third one. A staff with ranged healing and slowing capabilities. So score enemy kills or locate power-ups to charge it. Same thing. Shoot a focus beam of energy that slows and burns foes and heals allies. It can even revive players who are down, restoring their lost perks. Isn't that cool, guys? So basically, when you die, you're, you can there's like a a bar for all your perks, and slowly your perks go away. So you, and t the longer it takes you, someone to pick you up, the more perks you'll lose if you have any. And then if you don't have any, once you die, you come back with all your weapons that you already had. You don't start you don't start completely over. You don't lose everything. It's like keep it's like keep inventory with Minecraft. You get to keep everything, even if you die. You get to keep everything. It's not like it's off basically. So um. Let's look at the different stages for this. So, Ray of Life. Um, I already read that one. The second one is called Vigor. And look at the difference in the staffs. It's red. Mm, yeah. It's bigger, I guess. Um, so, gain resistance to catalyst damage. I don't know what the catalyst is. Or a catalyst, or whatever. And status effects when Scepter is active. 
And then your last ability is called Shining Beacon. Plant the scepter to create. Called Shining Beacon. Plant the scepter to create a protective bubble. Enemies inside will slow oh, no. will and be damaged. Players inside will automatically be revived with perks restored. So you have to get it all the way to level 3 to get that ability to restore your allies. Uh, revive them pretty much. So definitely work towards getting that if you have it. Um, and then the last um, special weapon on, the on zombies is called Viper and Dragon. A pair whip. A paired whip. Sword and hand cannon for mid-range uh, flexibility so this sword I guess is like a whip sword so yeah, I guess you can sling it around so the viper which is the sword and it says it's an ex extendable sword that acts like a blade whip bladed whip so a whip normally you swing around like a switch um, and it has a blade on the end of it so and then the dragon shoots fiery mid-range blasts kind of like a, a weapon a wonder weapon um, so that's what that is, and those do really good against um, the little gladiator dudes. So I normally use Viper and Dragon, and I'm going to do this by myself, so I'm definitely going to use Viper and Dragon. But I haven't used the other two, um, but I'm going to use Viper and Dragon, so at least you guys know what that's like. And then as far as all this goes, apparently I have everything. Wraith Fire, that's what everyone always uses. A sentry gun, are you serious? Uh, yeah, definitely going to use that. Wow, can't believe they have that. Okay, and then I've seen in zombies the um, the Cap 40 or whatever it's called, the, the pistol, automatic pistol, whatever that was in the game before. But I'm gonna show you these real quick. Um, just the classic ones. These are the ones you can use a limited amount of times. And then all the other ones, there's a there's a number next to it because that's how many you have because you get them. You start off with just these, all these, um, and you can get these two after. And kills zombies killed fall straight up. Ooh, I like that one. I think I used that before. Newtonian neg negation, and then these are like uh, whimsical, so they don't even they don't do anything good or bad. It's just like a four effect. And these ones, zombies wear a duck float, so they all the zombies will be wearing a duck float. I did that. I used that one before. I can use it in this one. Um, but anywhere, but okay. So always done swiftly. So these are the different perks I give to you. Walk, walk faster while aiming. So if you use it, you walk faster while aiming for five minutes, and it raises your raise and lower your weapon to aim more quickly. So if you're trying to aim quicker, that would be the one to use. This is called anywhere but here. Everyone says this is a good one to have. Instantly teleport to a random location. A, a concussive blast knocks away all nearby and its zombies, keeping you safe. So this is good. Everyone says when you're about to die, if you're like trapped. You know, you know, you get trapped a lot in a corner or something like that. This, this is when you. This is that was that would be when you would use this. I'm gonna go ahead and put this one for anywhere but here, so I can remember. And that one is that. But this one, okay. So let's look at the next one called Burnt Out. The next time you take melee damage, nearby enemies burst into fire. So that'd be good if you're getting hit and you know you don't want to. You can use it. And then, um, so this one's called Equipment. Refreshes cooldown on your equipment. Oh, I get it. Equipment. That is hilarious. Play on words. So it refreshes cooldown in your equipment, which mean it would mean for me my sentry gun or grenades if you had them. Head scan. Headshots have a chance to insta kill. So if you want to be able to do that for two minutes, have a chance for it to insta kill. That's when you would use that. Temporal gift. Power ups last longer. So the power ups would be insta kills and double points and and stuff like that it would make them last longer for five minutes and this one is called aftertaste keep all loadout perks after being revived non loadout perks are still lost when downed i don't even really know what a perk okay perks perk machine loadout perks loadout perks loadout perks i don't really know what a loadout perk is but You'll be able to keep them for five. This is last five minutes, or go or one if you get down once. That's how long it lasts. Point drops. Drop 500 of your points as a power up. Um, that's what it does. I don't really understand what that means. 
so people can drop up. Oh, if you need. Oh, wow. If you if someone else needs points, you can just do that. Boom, give them points. Now it's possible. Anti entrapment, immune to player initiated trap damage. That is pretty cool. So you can always activate this. So if you're stuck and you want to, you're about to go to a location and the person just activated a trap, you can turn this on and just walk directly through it without taking any damage. Nowhere but here. Teleport to a down player's location. So that's good. As it shows on the bottle, it's basically like Jesus coming down and helping you exactly at the moment you need it. So basically, this would be where you can teleport to the person that's down and then immediately start reviving them. Because um, zombies wouldn't be attacking them. You can, even you just wait a few seconds before you do it instead of directly when they get it. Because probably they're, you're going to be in the same situation they were just in around all those zombies. Um, now you see me. All zombies will chase you. So it's kind of like being a monkey for someone else. They're trying to do something like, hey, can you, can, you get these zombies off, can you get these zombies off my back? And then you're like, okay, yeah, sure. Now you see me. And then all the zombies will chase you. Uh, that's good one. One good way I can see you using it. Arsenal Accelerator. Charge your special weapon faster. So it is on a time clock. Um, so it doesn't tell you the exact amount of time you'll be able to use it. It's based on how many zombie kills you've got and also how many um, power-ups you pick up. I think there's a power-up that gives you full, it's called the full power pickup, uh, or full power-up, full power power-up, or something like that. And it, it just gives you, it basically refreshes your cooldown for your special weapon. This one just makes it go faster, so I guess when you do something it'll give you more towards it or something. Pop shocks. Auto activates when melee attacking zombies. Melee attacks trigger an electrostatic discharge, electrocuting nearby in zombies. I've never even seen this one. That's really cool. I'm going to have that one. Um, sh stock op option. Ammo is taken from your stockpile instead of your weapons magazine. That is cool if you have like a light machine gun or something. Um, or just any weapon and you want to be able to continue using it. So basically it takes you, it takes you out of the reserves that you have. You know, a gun has so much in its clip. And the thing you replace every time you run out of ammo. That it's saying instead of... Um, using that clip to tell uh, to show tell your gun how much ammo it has it'll use the overall amount which would be the big amount so you can shoot 600 bullets before you run out of you know before you have to reload instead of having to reload after 30 um, so that's good for that and it lasts for two minutes this one's called oh yeah I showed you these two Quagda rock <sighs> All right, cool. And then that is it for all of that. I showed you all these things. A talisman. I don't know what the heck these are. I yet to get any, so I don't have any. No reason to show them because I don't even know what to tell you about them. But let us start a game. It'll probably be short anyway. Let's go on this. And let us start it up. Oh yeah, and also, also you unlock weapons, the ability to put attachments on your weapons. So when you get them from the mystery box, it'll give, it'll already have the attachments you put on there before you start the game. Like if you were to go in a multiplayer. But I'll let you guys listen to this.
All right, that was the cutscene when you do it solo like they used to do. That was awesome. I don't I've ever never played it solo, so that was my first time seeing that. That was that was great. A great way to show it to adults. I wouldn't recommend kids seeing people being torn apart like that, but anyone that can understand that it's not real. And things like that don't even actually exist. Hello, that. anyone else around? Or did you all just sober up way too fast, huh? That'd be way Snap more comforting right to, to know that that is not the case. Looks like it's all on me. So one thing that you can do on here mm -hmm. is go over to these things. It says cut rope to claim your the challenge banner. Has been now on the middle left, you'll see knife kill 13 zombies. Stab, twist, it's a challenge. Dead. If I complete the challenge, then depending on which no. banner that I uh, cut. There's banners sitting at each corner. There's one right there for that god. One here for this god. I, I guess I did the one for Zeus. Um, so it'll show up. My prize will show up right here. I kill 13 zombies. So when I do, I've been. Um, okay, Scar. Whatever my reward work. is will appear here, and I have a ch chance to reject it. To find every crazy fucking hoop you'll need to jump through. I have a chance to reject it or to. Uh, Accept it and you know take whatever it is, <laughs> and then like certain levels there's Why use dogs ten normally. When one gets it done. Uh, I wonder how long this thing lasts. Are you serious? I just that just answer my question real quick. These freaks don't mind losing a limb. Let's see how they like losing a face. A brutal display. I'm so glad they're entertained. This is almost starting. One more to zombie. Way I, I too much of Dad's nonsense is starting to come true. If I can. And that Oracle gal didn't sound too optimistic about our chances. Jesus, girl talks a lot. Okay. Anyway. Boy, am I gonna give her a surprise when I wrap this shit up and get back to the cave? Okay. Anyway, when I get this last zombie, I will get a new challenge after I accept the last one. After I accept a gift from completing it, I'll get a new one. Well, I shot off part of you. That's got to count for something. And that's how they show up now. They show yes. up. You're not able Let's to immediately collect them. Indeed is done. A prize to be claimed. Uh. <laughs> Easy way to get killed is staying too clo getting too close. Viper and hey, let me just accept it first. Or I can use my Viper and Dragon, actually. The so, the Viper shoots three balls of things, and this one just knife kills. High shot kills. No, those are headshots, but hey. Yeah, so, good to use in the very beginning, so get your level, get the level up. Um. Yes. No, I do not need to be burned alive today. Thank you. I'm living with a baby, so excuse if excuse me if you hear it, hear her. She's a feisty one. Oh, I forgot the fire was on this side. Don't listen to them, Scarlet. You're still alive. I guess it alternates. I did not realize that's what it was doing. I thought it just wasn't going to happen at all. I was like, cool, no fire, awesome. I've got something for you, freaks, but you're not going to like it. I hate the slow ones. They mess up the training. Okay, this is the full power thing I was talking about, where it gives you full power so you can use your Slash your things again. Burn time, freaks. It's like a blade whip, so I swing it out in front of me. Bar going up as I use it, like the more kills I get with it, I'm guessing it's like a certain amount of kills you need to get. But I can open all these things, but I'll just stay here for a second. I need to get some headshot kills. Ah, I don't want that. I'll wait. Until hopefully. I don't want to get too high of a level. This will help me. This quick train. 
Who's got two guns and doesn't like getting backed into a corner? This gal. Oh, you're losing that hand now. I guess I'm not gonna take it. I must not. The challenge is finished. Another yep. awaits. That's that's called bonus points. It gives you more points. Just <laughs> a right amount of points. Witness Special the weapon. For glory. Gotta get more kills. I'll put a cork in it. The head wound, I mean. Bonus points. Oh, now they have helmets and I knock their helmet off? Wow. It's kind of like, uh, Plants vs. Zombies type of situation. Alright. I should have my special weapon and a couple more kills. And more... Sentry guns, which I thought were not going to be pointless, but apparently they are. I was like, what was that coming? Oh, what the heck? No help from the fire. See, that's when you it's use your special. If another way. zombie was to be behind me and I wouldn't be able to move, that's when you use your special. And you can slide. Never did like being the center of attention. Tigers. Undead fucking tigers. Sure, why not? Oh yeah, I said dogs or tigers. Rest in peace, kitty. If this is the walking dead, I'd be effed. Boom, crack, A thicker. challenge met. A god appeased. No! Oh. Call me the Dragon Slayer. Alright, and now I get this weapon. Uh, Z Harmony. I think it's called Harmony. Oh, I didn't, I didn't do anything. Satisfied. I didn't petition anyone, though. I didn't petition a god. I'm right here, not petitioning a god. I mean, I'm not doing it. Why you gotta lie on me? Why you lie? Why you lie? Why they lie? Oh, no, my ammo? Oh, well, I was supposed to get an ammo, wasn't I? Oh yeah, this crazy just happens. Need a light? Or they, they, may, they become other zombies. So it's pack-a-punched. I get a pack-a-punch weapon. So I'm full round inside the temple. Two power-ups. I hate crowds. And walking corpses. And torn to pieces. And now the max ammo's, uh... I don't know if you're used to the other ones. For me, I am. And the max ammo's used to... Just fill up your 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 overall amount to the two hundred to the two the two sixteen. If you look at my amount now, you used, used to fill up the two sixteen. Now it fills up the uh, all of it. It fills up your like actual clip and the amount you have left over. So that is pretty cool. Makes the max ammo more worth it. I'm inside the temple, I mean, what are they talking about? I guess I can't go up there. I think I heard someone say it's not considered the temple, so. Or inside one room. I don't really understand what I said. I'm gonna go back over here, though. Oh, boy. See the one with the blades? Oh, these guys. Because he sure sees us. Yeah, my, my special should be able to take care of these guys. <sighs> Anyone got a breath mint? <laughs> That's funny for how much they're screaming, yeah. I think I just got a full power up. Alright, you walking stiffs. Come meet my two best friends. A brutal display. I think they liked that. And now, now I have another one. So that's kind of how you can use that. Or you can use it so that it never runs out. Oh, you can just continue sports. to use it. But then Don't it'll worry. be ran up. So I'll spend it wisely. It's kind of better to just... Um, just do it. You know. Like I just did it. Use it all up and then use it if that's possible. If it can Only work out that way. Oh, what? That means there's going to be another one of those. I'm glad I got another one. Coming. Stupid lions. These are the lines, though. That's what happens when they I hit you. I am not Cat Chow. 
can't really train lions. They they do some weird move. They have weird movements. They kind of dance around you. You see, you get hit. You just you just randomly get. What the oh, hell fuck. is this place? Did they even have tigers in ancient Rome? Here, once you do three of them, you get this part. Come also. to me, my beauty. Max ammo. I don't know what the temple is. Maybe in there. I can do that. I can easily sort of run in there. Here, let me show you guys the temple. They all have one of these. This is where Electric Burst is. Oh, I could so take I you guys around the map. My nose where it doesn't belong. <sighs> Some things never this is stamina up. I didn't know I still had this. Whatever. Yes. Oh, I feel the power coursing through my limbs. Okay. Talk about weirdos, right? Um. Good thing I have all this money. You know, I wouldn't be able to do this if I didn't have money. Okay. So I know pack a punch is around here somewhere. And do those doors where pack a punch is. Oh crap, I gotta go. I have no clue to make like the um, riot shield or anything. I don't know where the parts Good are. Lord. The stench. Whatever that priest is trying but to I know do, this is one of the places you can do it. it. And it's called the pit. Good one, this is where the box oh, is. It's, it's there every game, so you can always go back there in that same place and uh, get that. Looks like the Pharaoh's trying to buy his way into heaven. Bowie knife is right here. Reminds me of someone. Always get that every game. Because it's one hit knives. Oh wait. Knocked him out of his socks pretty much. Uh I guess not round ten it's not two hits, but it's better than nothing. I guess I don't need to get through there. Oh wait, no I don't, yeah. Okay, you golden sadistic son of a bitch. Not only am I going to jump through all the hoops, I'm going to entertain your damn followers while I do it. Alright, I have to go this way to get over there. To the other side. Fellas, we've got trouble oh, coming. what? Trouble Whatever, you can be trouble all you want, but I'm getting through. I hope they realize that'll stain the tile. Not great for the pipes either. Oh, I was coming all the way up yeah, here right, just to. Good water feature. Let's just open this for now. Doesn't matter where you are or when you are, money talks. That's true. You just made my shit list, pal. Okay, now in these doors, this door and this door. Uh, wait, door over there. You have to open from the other side. You can't. You can only. Open it from one side, so. Make a hole, pug uglies. I've got other places to be. Wondering if they no, they don't attack the sentry gun. That's good. I'll cut through all of you. Oh, I get the money bastards. for it too. Yes. Look at that. Look at my points. Yes. I love when they don't take away my points for me actually getting the kills. That's, I'm literally getting the kills, Double and you're taking points. the man away. <laughs> Well, that was an easy round. Shit. I wish I knew how that works. I'd build one myself. This might be a very long video, actually. Thinking about it. Now I can just go back there and get perks when I need to. But I think the temple is up in one of those areas. I think that's why I was going there in the first place. Yeah, Electric Burst shocks them, so More that's tigers. the guy that's shocked. Because they seem to be avoiding us. Let me guess. It's Ooh. my perfume, right? Oh, yeah. I don't fucking wear perfume. Kill the blue ones. They make the others stronger. Hmm. Hell of a kick there, but it's worse for you. Alright, I'm good here right now. Wait. They're still spawning? Okay, well. Two. 
necessary. How many are left? And I love zombies. Okay, I think there's still only three left. Alright, let me go buy these perks now. I don't think I have quick revive, but that's whatever. This is the catwalk. Is it possible to distill a skunk? Because I'm pretty sure someone tried. Five thousand. No kick, jeez. Insta kill. Get him while the getting's good. So this is, I think, a temple. The temple. I don't really know what the temple is, really, but I'll try to. Oh. No, are you serious? Why? Must be ready for anything. Not this round. I'm not ready for it to the arena and do this. Big guys are just too much. Actually, is it gonna be good for the arena? I don't know. Yeah, the round where they let these guys out. Well, at least the axe guys have the good sense to cover their rotten faces. Yeah, the axe guys throw their axes and melee. Keep sending these guys. I'll keep putting them down. Yeah. What? Just two of them? I'm okay with that. Max ammo. All right, now I can I'll go take back. It and put it to good use. The lower wave, I the the less the wave is, um, the better it's going to be because they're going to be less hard. This is the crowd being sadistic, cheering us on as we try to survive this crazy situation. Look at these foxes, they move. Not foxes, I said foxes, whatever, just stop. P.U. That one is ripe. You guys are the neediest flesh eaters ever. It's embarrassing. Uh, fucking gas bag. Uh, oh, I know that happened. Burning. Uh. Oh, crap. Pup, you're dead. Got everyone even. Power. What just happened? Was it really you? Bro, you were epic. No one really lasts as long as you do. What was that option I had just now? It wasn't that, was it? Rebuild barrier. Let me check again. Oh, this. Don't start something you can't. Additional finish. part. Summon champion. Oh, okay. Hold on. Where do you have to go to do that? Let me try it again. Let's summon the champion. I think it's like a pack a punch here to summon these champions. The champion of Odin. I got meal kick. In the mix. Now I can get another gun. I choose it wisely. A brutal display. Okay. The champion of Odin is slain. Let's go do it here. Oh, you go right the there. Alright guys, so if you want to summon, do the pack-a-punch, you gotta nice get it from there. Guys hate me. You think I'd shot their dog or something. Not really gotta finish. Here, let me just... The champions of Zeus are slain! Now I can, uh... Do the ones over there eventually and get pack a punch. When I'm ready to pack a punch, I don't know really. I don't have to be do it right now. No. I gotta survive a full round Why in here anyway. Why do I hate shooting these tigers? It's not like they're cute or fluffy or even smell nice. Watch it! This one's a walking Tesla coil. There, everything's here? I mean, gosh. Me, that's what you get. Whoa. Oh, my gosh. 
You guys see that? That was epic. Don't make me go through you. Oh hell. I'm gonna do it anyway. No, I need I need I need something. And this is where the lot the second gun comes in. Jeez. I gotta go this way. Need more ammo. No way am I fighting these freaks hand to hand the rest of the For day. Real. That's not gonna happen. There's too many zombies. I gotta get down here as fast as possible, get this third gun. Only option I have, no, but I can hear them behind me. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Ow, you sneaky son of a bitch. This is what I got. I could have got that off the wall. Don't even think about getting back up. Maddox, it's better than nothing. Let's get through here. I don't even know where this is, but let's when I come up I will. So much stabbing. Double points. Points, money, whatever the hell you are, I'm investing in firepower. Whew, this is a uh, nerve wracking. Hey, rot jockeys, can we take a quick break? I need to restock. Yeah, didn't think so. Fire sale. Fire sale. Perfect. Magic box time. For ten bucks, you can't go wrong. I'm out of ammo. I need that can't ten say bucks. I didn't see this coming. Cause I'll have enough for two pulls of the box instead of just one. Come on, come on, come on! Give me something good. Ballistic yeah. knife. That's awful. I like these smaller guns. It's like they built them just for me. Crap. SMG. Scarlet's machine gun. No, went back to normal. <laughs> These gladiatorial assholes right. will ruin the day they guns. ever got in my way. All right, well I need to get back up there and challenge that dude real quick, so I can uh, get pack a punch open. Please tell me... Oh wait, this is the beginning of a round? Nah. Not a good time to do that. Oh, nuts. Of course. The flight father's here too. Well, nobody said this was gonna be easy. The dragon says, hello. That's well, name. really, goodbye. I'd rather be dead than look like you. <laughs> and it seems you agree. Fucking ghouls are everywhere. Sheesh. Damn, just about burned through my ammo. What exactly is a temple? Insta kill. No. I guess I haven't Scream been a full round in a shit. temple yet, so I wouldn't know if it was one. Because I haven't been doing it. Show them no mercy. They want to see a fight? 
Let's show him a fight. Okay, I think I'll be able to do it this time. I don't think there's any zombies in this. I don't know how many more of these bruisers I can take. PDW. In a hallucination because I ran out of bullets, I am gonna be livid. Jeez, I'm glad I have different guns. Keep them coming, Goldilocks. This is a bad spot, and getting worse by the second. I designed a kitten launcher when I was a kid. I meant it as a joke. What I wouldn't give for a tiger launcher. Alright, this is basically how I train uh, oh, yeah, in tight spaces. Oh no no no! This is where you use this. I hate crowds and walking corpses. No, and it was the wrong one. Pieces. No, I'm stuck. Damn it! Oh, this is you dumb. Now. Not like this. What, what what did I even use instead of the right thing? And why am I still down? I don't understand. Are you no serious? This crowd of assholes get to watch me die. This is ridiculous. Get me back on my feet. Why did I get to get back up in the first place? I need to know so I know what to do. I need to be I killing them. And lost too much to die in this hellhole. I've got something for you freaks, but you're not gonna like it. Finish what you start, Slackjaw. Great life lesson if you weren't, you know, already dead. Ha! Jeez. You're dead. No way am I sitting out the rest of this. Shove that claw down your throat if you try that again. Jeez, that was super close, guys. Time. I legit almost died. There's nothing stopping me from dying at that point. Oh, oh, that one went right to work. See, I got my extra weapon uh -oh. back when I use that. Oh, my bowels. All right, I'm gonna go back to the middle because I trust myself more there, and this is definitely a tight space. Not meant for that type of thing. Uh, I need to challenge those two things next. Get to get the um. This is a bad spot, and getting worse by the second. If I can figure out a way. Jeez, zombie, you're, all, you're on my butt. Jeez, one more hit and I'm out. That's not need to happen. Alright, cool. And by the way, the more you...